what's up amazing beautiful people welcome to my youtube channel thank you for clicking and this day has started really nicely yeah i've decided to meet up with my friend so that at least we can catch up and then you know eat some fast food and then what? we have an amazing day she's washing her hands there so let her wash her hands she's walking majestically <laughs> Say hi to the people. I love your hair. Thank you. Hi. Well, what's your what's your hair brand? Like it's beautiful. Can I see? Wow, it's beautiful. Eh, hey, you're looking gorgeous. Thank you. Girl. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, my hair brand is Fulani. Fulani braids. Yeah. Wow. Tell them to subscribe. Subscribe, like, and comment. Thank you. <laughs> catch up and then I'll talk to you later yes. <laughs> Nigga content. Hi, content. TikTok. YouTube. Hi guys, I found this amazing aloe vera in so healthy. I want to pick one so that at least I can use it for my face. Do you see how beautiful it is? Let me pick one, but I'm afraid of the thorns. Boy. Yeah, at least I've picked this one. I'm going to use it on my face. Wow. Hi, guys. I was taking an evening stroll, and this in my home area. Yeah. And I love it. So, I just wanted us to share something little. Let me walk to this side. I was kind of bored in the house. Yeah. So this is where I'll be sitting. I hope I'll not find any snakes here on the rock. Wah, 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 wah. Hmm. Hi guys. So I just wanted us to talk a little bit uh, of how to become a millionaire. And I'm just outside watching and enjoying the sun guys yeah i think there's a car coming let me first wait so that at least just a minute so guys i wanted us to talk about a little bit of business here and there so i wanted us to talk about how to become a millionaire you know yeah everyone in life in this life wants to become a millionaire yeah, don't worry. I'm outside. I'm outside the nature. Outside our home compound. Yeah. So, number one. I know I'm not yet a millionaire. But I am working towards becoming a millionaire, guys. So, the number one thing that you need to do if you want to become a millionaire. It's something that I've talked to other millionaires. And I'm going to be bringing in a new series asking like people how they made their millions so that's why i started this series here today yeah so the number one thing that i learned from millionaires is that they set a clear goal so if you want to become a millionaire make sure you set a clear goal yeah because you can't say that i want to make hundred thousand tomorrow i want to become a millionaire tomorrow no it's not easy you have to like you have to set a clear goal like you can tell yourself in like two to three years or in five years time i want to become a millionaire and this is what i'm going to be doing -da 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 -da. Yani you you set your goals that's your number one thing because what you think is what you become okay guys yeah, number two, if you want to become a billionaire, make sure to set um, 
yani work build a profitable business and there are many types of businesses so long as uh, the business that you're doing is is making profits you can work hard towards it okay uh, being employed i'm not sure you can not many people become millionaires by being employed unless maybe you're employed and then you set up a side hustle at least you don't depend on the employment only but i've seen others who have become millionaires by being employed let's say like yeah like people who work in high end offices you know you can but most of these jobs that we have here for common mwana um, inchi or common people it's hard to become a millionaire when you're being employed so the number one thing is that you have to build a profitable business and especially business in manufacturing or just any types of business build business because at least if you have a business you can leave it to your children okay guys yeah and please like this video comment like and share guys yeah i'm just outside here chilling and having some good time number three if you want to become a millionaire make sure you manage your finances wisely so there is that out of a hundred percent when you get your let's say salary or your income let's say 60 percent goes to your 60 percent goes to your needs house rent it's etc and then you can save maybe 30 percent for a rainy day and 10 percent of course as christians we give tithe to god never forget that if you're if you want to become a millionaire guys we are all working towards that so make sure to 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 do that another thing is surround yourself with successful people I didn't say that you edit out the people who are not doing well but most of the time make sure you surround yourself with people who are doing who are like successful already who are millionaires already and by doing this is because the company that you keep is what builds you if today you you stay a lot with people who let's say drink every day you know drinking is not bad for the people who drink anyway but i'm just saying if you surround yourself with people who have no vision who have no goals then probably you are going to be the next one but if you surround yourself with four millionaires you're going to become the next so surround yourself with successful people and successful people want to surround themselves also with people who have here yeah, like people who have who have built themselves make sure like you read a lot of books you are knowledgeable and you any you you have wits you are also wise in a way yeah it's kind of dark but i'm loving the view so don't worry i was just actually bored in the house i'm kind of stressed out my daughter was not feeling well i don't know what's this fever guys all the time all my children had had this disease like they had this vi there is this viral outbreak uh, cough whereby they vomit they get fever they are not eating it's draining me guys but at least the others have turned out well so my small one is the one that's kind of fussy all the time so i didn't even go anywhere oh my god i'm just afraid that there is no snake here guys <laughs> yeah so another thing if you want to become a millionaire is surround your uh not surround yourself guys i'm reading i had to jot down some notes so that at least i can give you some content develop a millionaire mindset a millionaire mindset is whereby you know that first of all to become a millionaire is to have multiple streams of income don't depend on one income like at least sometimes you know like for me last month youtube didn't pay me because my views are so so low so at least what has been helping me is that at least i have a soap a soap business so if youtube is has have not received the paycheck soap business at least it's sustaining me 
at least you can find that at least I can buy food, I can pay this and that, even if it's not that much, but at least I have an extra source of income and I'm also looking to have another one, guys. Yeah, so make sure you have multiple streams of income. Do not depend on one income only. Okay, guys? And make sure you read a lot of books, you read a lot on investments. For example, even YouTube, the, the un YouTube University, it's really nice. You can learn a lot about business. And another thing, if you want to become a millionaire, learn how to do sales. Because when you do sales, it's never easy. Like sometimes, for me, when I go to do sales of um, selling soaps, hey, guys, it's never easy. First of all, you can meet people. You tell them, hi, my name is Eve. I have a fruit soap, blah, blah, blah. And then they're like, uh, not today, not today. Please get out of my office or get... Yani, they reject you so badly until you're like, hmm. But you, with time, because I've been doing it for six years, I've learned to become hard-hearted. Or you see someone has actually a lot of acne and pimples. You tell them, hi, my name is Eve. Uh, I, I make soaps for acne, pimples, black spots. I want to like, you know, uh, help you out in your skincare journey and then they're like I'm fine who told you that I need the soap and then you're like hmm. so it's never easy but all in all not everyone rejects me actually because at least I usually like meet people who buy and they become customers and they refer to many people and yeah at least I've tried to build a brand but it's not easy guys at least I work I work so hard and it's tiresome yeah so learn learn sales that's the number one thing if you want to become a millionaire learn to sell yourself out there like if you have a product that you're selling learn how to sells and maybe with time we can be talking about how to how to do sales how to become a good salesperson maybe one of the tips that I can give you is that you need to bet brush your teeth well because first of all you cannot go out there to do sales and your mouth is stinking guys you know it can't happen or maybe your hair is not kempt you you are wearing clothes that have crises or they are dirty so the number one thing that you have to do when you are doing sales is to be presentable make sure you bath well you wash your clothes even if you don't have spray you can add a uh, fabric softener like downy or star soft in your clothes and they'll smell nicely and you brush your teeth make sure you even if you've not braided your hair you comb it nicely so that you can be presentable because as much as people don't people shouldn't judge your outlook but people judge anyway you can't go there with a hair that is not kempt you you're smelling weirdly and then you expect people to buy from you no yeah so land sales and another thing maybe is to be patient and persistent for me i've been doing soap business for the past six years it it has not been easy but i'm always persistent i'm always patient i'm working hard and maybe you never know with time i will I will become a millionaire guys and for you out there if you also want to become a millionaire make sure you follow these tips and if you have any other tip that you have please comment on the comment section and I will so so much appreciate it guys just watch my ads try to watch my videos if you have time and thank you for the love that you have been showing me I am so grateful I would never be here where I am today if it was not for you. Yeah, and another thing before I finish, take risks. You know, you can't be a millionaire. Oh, sorry, my, I think there was a text popping up. You can't be me a millionaire if you're not taking risks, you know. There was a time when I was watching like, you know, at times I watched Miss Trudy's vlog and she was saying she took a risk to go and meet Wodema in Ethiopia. She didn't have enough money, but she just took a risk. 
And just the same way that uh, I did, I took a risk to go and meet Marwa so that at least we can do a collab together. I didn't even have fear to go back. It was crazy, but I think it was time. So take calculated risks. Of course, I knew that if one, two, three doesn't happen, I had a plan B, but I took a risk. So in this life, you have to take a risk. Yeah, don't just sit there, be comfortable. Comfort zone will kill you. Yeah, make sure to take risk in life and be more knowledgeable. Okay, guys, I think I'm going to end my video from here. Thank you for watching this vlog. See you next time. Bye, guys. Mwah, mwah, mwah. I love you so much. Let me go and attend to the baby. Yeah. I'll see you later and also cook for the children. It's almost 7 p.m. here. I love you so much. Mwah, mwah, mwah.